hey what's up guys welcome back you are watching for tech so one day ago we released the video regarding the update of oxonus 12.1 c06 build you can check that from the icard in the video we discuss all the features bugs and the fixes but i did not show on is it possible to downgrade to the oxonus 11 on this version and answer is yes lots of people told me that they didn't got this update even their devices are on the oxonus 11 a20 along with the people who are on the oxonus 12 c05 build so today in this video we will discuss how to downgrade to the Oxonus 11 OT update notification issue mentioned by the users and I also found one major issue in this update so watch the video till the end. Now without further ado, let's get started. First we need to download the downgrade package given in the video description, place it in the root of the storage. This is the same downgrade package given by the OnePlus for the Oxonus 12C05 build. This process will wipe the data so take the full backup before proceeding. Now go to the about phone and tap on the Oxonus icon tab available at the top of the setting. Next tap the three dot menu from the top right corner. Locate your downloaded downgraded package. Now system will start to verify the update. Once the verification gets completed, it will show you the downgrade package details. This is the Oxonus 11 A19 update. Now tap install and system will get rebooted and flashes the update. Last it will wipe the data. So we booted to the Oxonus 11. If you check the version tab in the about phone, now we are downgraded to the Oxonus A19 version. So let's check out the issues. The people saying they are not getting the update even on the Oxonus 20. So first I upgraded to the Oxonus A20. Then I checked the software update two three times and I didn't got any new software update of Oxonus 12C06 that I received on the 13th of the July. People who are on the Oxonus 12C05 they also not got any update notification for this new update. It seems true that the OnePlus taken down this update on the 30th of July. We don't know the exact reason behind this action. As per my users that the Oxonus C06 has the good battery performance and the stability. But I downgraded now so I can't able to share the battery results with you and it's of no use if you didn't have the C06 OTA available. If you are advanced level user and uses the MTK client application then you will face major issue in the C06. I tried several times to connect my device in ADL mode to the PC but it doesn't detect it, my phone in the MTK client. Every time it's shown the handshake error so I was not able to take the backup of Oxonus 12C06 and I can't able to share it with you now. That's why I downgraded to the Oxonus 11 to check the issue is it really persist in the C06 or not. After downgrading to the Oxonus 11, MTK client easily detected my device as you can see on the screen. Actually it's also working for the Oxonus C04 version but later on for the Oxonus 12C05 and the C06, it's broken the EDL mode along with the fast boot. So it seems that the OnePlus again made a blunder for the advanced users. Still I have the faith in the company, soon they may release the revised version of C06 with the, all these bugs fixes. Till then, if you think I help you, then please do like and share this video. Subscribe our channel, press the bell icon for the notification of our upcoming content. Thanks for watching, see you next time, take care, bye bye.